the circuit of Zolda, the venue of the European Truck Racing Championship, round six. Jochen Hahn extends his series of pole positions, the ninth in a row for the dominant German driver. Next to him is Antonio Albafetti, second, just five hundredths behind Jochen Hahn. The Belgian circuit is traditional in the ETRC calendar. It's an old-fashioned track, exactly four kilometres in length. Adam Lachko, starting third, is hoping for a good result. On board with Lachko at the start of race one. Hahn has wheel spin. He's attacked by Lachko and Albafetti. And Albafetti, with better acceleration, takes the lead. Albafetti leads, followed by Hahn and Lachko. In the middle of the pack, there's an attacking move by David Jenkins. The new entry, the race by race driver, is too optimistic. Ollie James gets a push. On lap 10 at turn one, Jochen Hahn overtakes Antonio Albafetti for the race lead. Albafetti was blocked the turn before by Dominic Orsini in the Mercedes. That was the reason that Hahn had a chance. Next lap, on board looking back for Norbert Kisch's truck. He's fifth. And behind the overtake of Steffi Hahn against Rene Reinert for sixth place. At the chequered flag, Jochen Hahn takes a tenth victory of the season. Nobody can beat him. Second, Antonio Albafetti, and third for Adam Lachko in the Freightliner. <laughs> Big applause for the reigning champion on the top step of the podium here at Zolder. Jochen Hahn, the winner from Antonio Albafetti and Adam Lachko. <laughs> For race two, it's a reverse grid of the top eight finishers of race one. So Terry Gibbon is on pole, eighth in the first race. On board with Antonio Albafetti. And it shows all the confusion going on behind him. David Jenkins, Ollie James, Jose Rodriguez, they're all involved. And Irving Klein Nagelvoort in the Scania goes through the gravel. Fabio Citignola crashed into Jenkins. And Citignola, with a broken track rod, is going no further. A red flag. And a second start didn't work because of a crash between Orsini and Klein Nagelvoort. The third start, only ten more laps to run. On board with Albafetti, the Spaniard, fourth ahead of Lachko. Then it's Hahn and Kurzin. On lap three, the top eight is close together, but René Reinhardt leads from Steffi Halm, then Norbert Kisch, Albafetti, Lachko, Hahn, Kurzin and Sasha Lentz, all of them covered by less than four seconds. At the chequered flag, René Reiner takes the win, his third ETRC win this season, after winning in Bassano and Bosch, both in race two. Harm and Kiss complete the podium. René Reiner, the race winner, Steffi Harm second, and Norbert Kish takes third. Race one of Sunday, race three of the weekend. Jochen Hahn is again on pole position, a tenth faster than Adam Lachko. Lining up third on the grid, Robert Kish. It's another big crowd at Zolder, over 14,000 spectators over the weekend as the lights go green for race three. They dive down to the first corner. Andre Kurzim gets a hit from René Reinert. Looking back from Antonio Albafetti, Reinert tucked up behind him. It's great action for the fans. On board with Kurzim, he's fighting Albafetti for fifth on lap eight. Kurzim just stays ahead. On lap 10, Reinert and Sasha Lentz are fighting for seventh. Lentz in the gravel on the right-hand side of the track and then in the gravel on the left. But that is one visit too many. This time, he's stuck. At the chequered flag, Jochen Hahn takes a tenth victory of the season, followed by Adam Lachko and Norbert Kish, nearly eight seconds behind the winner. The ladies, Hahn and Lachko. The podium topped by Jochen Hahn with Adam Lachko and Norbert Kish. Race four and another reverse grid of the top eight. So Jamie Anderson is on pole, Rene Reinert lines up second on the grid, the winner of the equivalent race the day before. The fans are ready, and at the start, Jamie Anderson keeps the lead, followed by Rene Reinert and then Antonio Albafetti. Albafetti challenges on the inside and goes ahead of Reinert. Then Andre Kurzim comes up to challenge. 
Reiner is down to fourth. Adam Lachko chases Norbert Kish. The Czech driver, though, has a brake problem. He crashes into the back of Kish, and Lachko is out of the race. On board now with Antonio Albafetti. Looking back at Andre Kurzev, but Albafetti is attacking Jamie Anderson for the race lead. He gets ahead of the British driver on lap five. Anderson is also overtaken by Kurzim, and the rest of the pack all comes streaming through within the next 800 metres. Ultimately, he drops to seventh. Jose Rodriguez has technical problems. He also did a jump start, but it's not the drive through this time. The chequered flag for Antonio Albafetti for his second win of 2019, ahead of Andre Kurzim and then Rene Reinert in third place. But Jochen Hahn leads the championship by 85 points from Albafetti. And another good weekend for the German. Antonio Albafetti wins here for Andre Kurzim and Rene Reinert.